Hi, welcome back to Video Product Vlogger's channel. In this video, we'll show you how to create a newspaper transition effect using Video Product Vlogger. If you're interested in this, keep watching. Before we get it started, we need to prepare some footage, including newspaper clips and a green screen transition clip. You can download all of them using the links listed below the video. Then open Video Product Flagger and import the newspaper clips we just prepared. Add one of the newspaper clips on the video track. In the Transform section on the right side, click Video Screen. Next, place the other newspaper clip on the overlay track, also clicking Fade to Screen. Use the Ripple Edit tool to adjust the duration of the clip on the video track to around 6 seconds. Adjust the clip on the overlay track to around 3 seconds. Once we're done, select the clip on the overlay track. Click here to enter the motion editor and set a keyframe on the far left of the timeline. Adjust the selection box to fit the screen. After that, add the second keyframe at the far right end of the timeline. Slightly reduce the size of this selection box and rotate it a little bit. Finally, position one corner of the selection box over the blank space in the newspaper, while holding the other corner Scale down the selection box to its minimal size. At this point, the preview window on the right should be white. Last, change the speed to speed up and click apply to return to the main interface. Now we get this. It seems like we're moving into the newspaper. Next, create a new overlay track and use copy and paste to duplicate the newspaper transition clip we just created onto the new track. Then click on the eye icon here to hide the upper overlay track and the video track. Now select the clip on the bottom overlay track. Find the chroma key and click on this small box. Use the eyedropper tool to sample the background color of the newspaper. After clicking down, check enabled. Adjust the values of tolerance and smoothness. Keep only the text from the newspaper. Then enable both tracks. Select the clip in the middle overlay track. Find the fade and move. Check fade out and adjust the duration to around 1.6 seconds. This completes the newspaper fly through effect. Now let's select the clip on the video track. Click here to enter the motion editor. Add the first keyframe on the far left. Adjust its selection box to fit the screen. Then add the second keyframe on the far right. Slightly reduce the size of the selection box to create a zoom in effect. Click apply to return to the main interface. Next. Import the green screen clip into the middle of the overlay track, placing it behind the newspaper clip and fitting it to the screen. Then use the chroma key to remove the green color from the footage. Tweak the values of tolerance and smoothness to achieve the best result. Once we're done, use the split function to trim off unwanted parts. Now we can export this video. Next, remove all the clips from the timeline. Place the video we just exported on the overlay track. Make sure it fits the screen. Import whatever clip you like and drag it onto the video track. Move the playhead until you see the blue screen in the preview window. Use the chroma key to remove the blue color. Now we get this stunning newspaper transition effect.
That's all for today. If you want to know more editing tricks or what has been going on with Video Prac Flagger, be sure to click the subscribe button to subscribe to our channel. See you in our next editing tutorial. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.